from Spain to New York and all the way to the central west of New South Wales. Music is just one way communities are staying connected and in control while some of history's toughest social restrictions are in full force. But one folk band isn't letting their delayed debut tour of the region get in the way of sharing their music. So when we found out we weren't going to be able to do the physical tour, we've been trying to stay connected online on social media. Um, so every week we're releasing a cover. Yeah, just trying to stay connected and trying to still put something out there. Through whatever platform and wherever in the world, making or listening to tunes helps people to form a collective identity. A sense of community and belonging helps to break down the sense of isolation that many of us are going to be experiencing and it actually creates community spirit. It may also be the key to improving not only our mental but also physical health. Music actually uh, releases oxytocin, so the feel-good hormone, and we know that music increases well-being. And so in a time when we need to do everything we can to raise our immune systems, maybe it is that music can play a role in that. Because there's no physical gigs to go to, it kind of is breaking down barriers. I've noticed that some people are actually getting more online exposure and more opportunities than they were before. It felt almost like everyone was closer through social distancing because we were all going through it together. I'll be your Xanthi Gregory, CSU.